come on in. What's up? What's good? What's popping? What's cracking? What's percolating? What is really good in the hood? It is your man, Theo Butler, and welcome to a Put Your Money Where Your Mouth Is episode of I Ain't Saying, I'm Just Saying, with the Rock With Me Nation. Y'all go ahead and clap that thing on up. Hey, let's go. Before we begin, like, share, subscribe. If you like, leave a comment. If you don't like, leave a constructive comment. If you want to say something else, you can. I'm going to make sure I put the link in the description and in the comment section so y'all can go check on that. So, honoring Chadwick Boseman. Quite a few of us talk about it. A lot of talk about that. A lot of talk about it. Honoring, how do we honor Chadwick Boseman though? How how do we honor him? There, there are a plethora of ways of honoring him, but continuing his legacy. Well, to continue Chadwick Boseman's legacy, you first must ask yourself. What is Chadwick Boseman's legacy? What is it? What's one thing that most of us, if not all of us, could say about Chadwick Boseman? What is it? Yeah, we could say that he was an actor. We could. We could. All of us can't say he was a loving husband because he was only married to one person. Lapita Nwongo can't say that because y'all love to keep throwing her name. You just can't say that. Simone can. Oh. Everybody can't say he was a loving brother. Kevin and Derek can't. We can't. We can't say that. We can't. They know. In essence, all the speculation, innuendo, conjecture, if not out and out lies, are exactly that. If you didn't know the man personally, you didn't know the man personally. But that did not mean you could not learn about the man. The man's story is, is to be found. His story is well documented. You just have to want to look. You have to want to learn. And you have to say to yourself, some of the stuff that you find out about him, you might not agree with. But you're not going in to find out about him what you agree with. You're going in to find out about Chadwick Bozeman, right? Right. Come on, somebody. I don't want to talk about anybody else's tears. Hell, I'm not going to say I'm crying out when it comes to Chadwick Boseman, but this video right here, I got my emotions in check. So I don't have to cry this particular episode. But because we honestly, we've seen other people cry about Chadwick Boseman. But in crying about Chadwick Boseman, and telling you how much they love about Chadwick Boseman, have you heard the consistent message from Chadwick Boseman? See, his message shouldn't be lost because he's not here to say it. If we want to honor him and continue his legacy, what we do is we make sure his message carries on. If you know Nothing else about the man, he was selfless, right? We should be able to look that up in a dictionary, use our cell phone, use our mobile devices to see what the definition of selfless is, right? Cool. He was caring. We got that with Ian and Taylor. So we should be able to use our cell phones, our mobile devices, and pull up what the definition of caring is, right? So we got giving and we got caring. Hold on. So here it is. It's been on my mind for a minute now. Y'all know I've been talking about ways in which I believe Chadwick Boseman would truly be honored. And I was like, okay, well, Howard, they named the, their performing arts school, the Chadwick Bozeman College of Fine Arts. I was trying to find their phone number 
Anybody could have did this. Anybody could have did it that wanted to do it. I wanted to do it. It been on my mind for a minute. So here we find the website, Chadwick Bozeman College of Fine Arts, 100% Howard University, giving. We see the donation. You can give it $25, $50, $75, $100, other reoccurring gift. Reoccurring, that's not a word. Recurring gift. Make this a monthly gift, tribute gift. This gift is in honor, memory, or support of someone. We could definitely use that. Billing address, make this gift on behalf of an organization. We could say recast the child. We could say honor Chadwick Bozeman because we know I'm thinking that there are anti recasters that want to honor Chadwick Bozeman because that's what I've been hearing. So in doing this, it shouldn't matter whether you want the character of T'Challa recast or not recast. This is about honoring Chadwick Bozeman. So you put your name, your email address, you put your phone number if you want to, address, city, state. I would like to remain anonymous. Payment details, credit card, direct debit, secure payment. All I'm going to do is, is the monies that I would have spent on Black Panther 2. It's like five, six, seven, eight of us. I'm just going to send that money to Howard. I, To me, that's better than that's how you honor the guy. Hold on. Talk about it. Be about it. I've been talking about this last year. I was going to call the school to see how to donate funds to the school. But Google, I didn't even have to do that. All I did was have, all I did was type in donate funds to the Chadwick Bozeman School of Performing Arts. That came up. What is this about? Regardless of whether you want the character recast or not, the prevailing sentiment has been, we love the actor. I've had the fortune or misfortune on being on some panels, watching some panels, when people be so cavalier when they talk about how much they love Chadwick Bozeman. Nobody else could do it like Chadwick Bozeman, even though no one else has been given the opportunity. Chadwick Bozeman stood for opportunity. He stood for more opportunity for black actors and actresses alike. He did. His statement was he wanted there to be more of us, not less of us, not the same number of us. No, he wanted that number to grow. So how do we do it? How do we honor a man who was selfless, giving, and who wanted to ensure that there were more opportunities for black actors and actresses? Me for mine, when Black Panther 2 comes out, I won't be doing that. I'll be sending the monies. And it's probably going to be close to 100 when I think about everybody in my family that I was going to take to go see that movie. It'll be $100 headed toward the Chadwick Bozeman School of Performing Arts. What I will do is the day that my will release this movie. Hey, Kevin. Hey, Nate. Hey, Ryan. Hey, cast and crew. The date you drop the movie is the date I'm going to send them monies to Howard. And I'm encouraging everybody who says that they love Chadwick Bozeman, who says that they miss Chadwick Bozeman, who says that they want to honor the legacy of Chadwick Bozeman. I'm encouraging you as well to send monies to Howard to ensure that we have other actors and actresses 
like Chadwick Boseman. So we never have to hear someone who looks like Chadwick Boseman, Anthony Mackie, ever utter the words again that no one will ever be able to replace that actor. No, see, we can't replace the man, Anthony. Chadwick Boseman can't be replaced. Let me say that one more time. There's a difference between the man and the actor. Just like there's a difference between the actor and the character. The man, we will never be, be, be able to replace the man. Never. But actors, my brother. Actors. Because see, somebody was acting before you started. So you replace somebody. It's just a damn shame. You don't get it. That's my suggestion. It's right there. The link is right there. You can click. If you want to donate money, you can right now. You don't have to wait till the movie comes out. If you want to go see the movie and donate money to Howard as well, so be it. If you don't want to go see the movie and you want to say, damn that movie, I'm going to take the monies that I would have used on that movie and I'm going to send them to Chadwick Boseman School, by all means, go right ahead. I'm telling you what I'm going to do. And I went out here to do something that the cast and crew hasn't done. I've actually given you a way to participate in honoring the actor and the man that we all say we love. I ain't saying, I'm just saying. Oh, before you go, click, like, share, subscribe. We on our way to 500. And after 500, it's on our way to 1,000. I ain't saying, I'm just saying. Peace.